how to connect your BM800 condenser to your computer. Hey, what's up mga kabrad? Uh, so last video is nag-unbox tayo sa BM800 condenser at re-review natin yung setup. So today is, I'll be teaching you how to connect your BM800 condenser to your computer. So let's get to it. You need two connections. The USB sound card, which is a 7.1 external with 3.5mm USB audio adapter and the phantom power. So this is what a phantom power looks like. And this is what a USB sound card looks like. I'll attach a link below kung saan ko in order ito online. So here are the cord connectors. Cord A. This connects to the outlet or the power source. Cord B. This connects to the USB sound card. Cord C. This connects to the microphone. Step 1 Step 1 Connect cord C from the microphone to the phantom power Step 2 Connect cord B from the USB sound card to the phantom power. Step 3. Connect cord A from the phantom power to the outlet or to the power source. Step 4. Switch on the phantom power. Step 5. Connect the USB sound card to the USB port of your computer. You can see that it's working when the lights go on and off. So ayan, you're all set now with your connections. Next is we need the software kung saan tayo mag-record gamit ang ating BM800 condenser. You need to install Audacity. My link sa ibaba and it will direct you to the site. It's safe and it's also free. Mic check, mic check, mic check, mic check. My, 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 my. My check, my check. tutorial sa Audacity para maging mas maganda yung recording mo, yung settings niya, click on this video. Uh, so I don't know, I hope you find that video tutorial helpful. And uh, just a small favor lang po, I hope you would subscribe to this YouTube channel para we can still continue making tutorial videos like this one. And then also leave a comment below kung ano yung products na gusto nyong i-review namin para we'll read your comments, we'll order the product, and then we'll review the product for you before nyo we order online. So, ayun, peace!